Capitol Police Chief and other officials were called to testify before a House panel concerned about a recent series of assaults or attempted assaults against members of Congress and their staff in close proximity to the Capitol complex. A CBS News review of court filings and police records shows a quick succession of incidents dating back to last February when Minnesota Democrat Angie Craig was punched in the face by a man who got into her Capitol Hill apartment complex and accosted her in the elevator. She only escaped after throwing hot coffee at the attacker and running out, escaping at the next elevator stop. He's pleaded guilty, now serving prison time. A few weeks later, outside a restaurant in Northeast D.C., a Senate staffer was stabbed, suffering some significant injuries. The person believed responsible for that is also under arrest and facing court proceedings.